Tonight, new documents shedding light on what was going on inside the mind of the accused UNC Charlotte gunman. Search warrants show he targeted a specific table of people. NBC Charlotte's Tanya Mendez has been going over the warrants page by page today. And Tanya, they paint a pretty chilling picture of what may have happened. A very chilling account in this search warrant that I have here in my hands. Not only does it explain what the suspect did in the classroom, but it also shows what officers found when they went into his apartment. In the hours after the chaos and life lost at UNCC, we saw officers with vests on, guns drawn, canines sniffing around the suspected mass shooter's apartment. And now we're learning more about what they found when they went inside. This is the search warrant for the alleged gunman's apartment. It outlines the chilling preparation he appeared to take before opening fire on campus. Detectives discovering paper targets set up inside the apartment, plus six boxes of ammo, three handgun magazines, and a magazine loader. Witnesses describing to police what happened that day, saying the gunman slammed the classroom door open, pointed a gun at them, walked up to a particular table, and began firing at the students sitting there. According to the affidavit, when a UNCC police sergeant got on scene, he had to ask the students in the classroom who the gunman was, as if the shooter was trying to blend in with the victims. The affidavit says the suspect admitted it was him. When police arrested him, they found a Glock and a black leather bag that had multiple gun magazines. And according to this search warrant, that classroom that the suspect targeted was the only class that he was attending. He'd already dropped out of the rest of his classes on campus. Reporting at UNCC, I'm Tanya Mendes, NBC Charlotte.